don't like me because you think that I am an Arab. What? No. What are you talking about? Something like that. Excuse me. Wait. That oh, wait, boy. I, I, I am his mentor. I am so proud of you. What do you mean, a mentor? Don't worry about that. Okay, so what you got for him? James De Santa. Some kid. He is already late on his payments, and I have this bad feeling that he will do more damage to the car than we can get back from him in the exorbitant interest rate payments. Huh? Just go and get it. The house is on um, uh, Hampstead uh, off Eclipse. It's an SUV. Huh? Some Rockford Hills daddy's boy nonsense. Don't worry about it. Try to bring the car back in good condition, huh? I got you. Don't worry about it. It's so good to see you, my boy. Hey, good luck in uh, law school, huh? So, Mr. Kenneth, where are we at? Uh, financing? Oh, oh, shit. Hey, did you change your mind? When I discover that you betray me, perhaps. I hear you took the bike for yourself, my employee of the month. Listen, man, me and Lamar was gonna get that back to you, dawg. Oh, I am sure. You will get this car off the daddy's boy, and then we talk. Insurance papers say they have a locked garage, so you'll need to gain access from inside the house. Man, it's never easy with you, is it, Simeon? Do not talk to me about easy, you thief. Just because you have a massive gaper, bitch! Fucking homo, you're dead! Dead! He said I had a massive... Jimmy called me a bitch! He tried to... I'll cut your dick off if you call the administrator. Hey, you know what? I am the administrator. You're a real pro, Mrs. DeSanta. A real pro. Hey, Simeon, I got the ride, man. I'm coming back. Yeah, if you actually bring the repossession to me this time, I can have it back out on the street before the day is done. That's a 9mm semi-automatic pushed against your skull. Huh? Now look around. You just keep driving where you're going. Hey, come on, man. This was a repo job. Guy was behind on this fucking note. Unlikely, considering my son just got the car. And looking at the way you're going about this, my guess, you're working a credit fraud. A credit fraud? Be serious, dude. I just worked the fucking repo. I appreciate a kid who follows orders without taking responsibility. Yeah, maybe one day we'll have a beer, and I'll explain how the world really works. Who gives you the slip? A car dealer, dawg, by the name of Simeon Terry. So this businessman, he look legit to you? Look, man, it's just between him and your fucking son. Don't worry. Me and Mr. Yatarian. We'll work this out. Hey, man. It's Jess up here. Okay. Stop the car. Pull up. That the place? Yeah, this the place, man. Whoa. Drive into it. Right through the fucking window. And fast. Or I'll put two rounds in the back of your skull and do it myself. Man, you can't be for real. I look like a fucking joke to you. Man, fuck my life, man, fuck. Ram it already. Man, shit! No! Three 
Franklin! What the fuck are you doing? Mr. Samuel, it's not exactly how it looks. I always trump big for a job well done. Now get out of here, kid. You motherfucker! See now, you've pissed me off! Are you brain dead? You think oh. you could take me for a ride? You recognize this car? Huh? Does it look like it's worth five grand a month to you? You fucking racist! I'm Tyson. This thing's gonna need some serious body work before it's worth five grand a month. <laughs> ah, he agreed to financing I have his signature. Yeah, did he agree to have some punk break into my fucking house? I, I don't know. I, uh... That kid might be a fucking idiot, but you are a fraudulent scumbag piece of shit. Oh. Don't make me have to come back here. Come by for that drink you offered, that's all. I wasn't really serious about that. What? Uh, you're here, whatever. Sit. You're not gonna rob me again. Man, I never robbed you. That was just a repossession. Okay. You call it whatever you want to call it. I really don't care. What can I do for you? Shit, I just came by to see if there's something I can help you with. I see you doing well for yourself. Look. I'm retired. Ain't you a bit young for the pipe, slippers, and staring at a fucking sunset? You know, I've been in this game for a lot of years, and I got out alive. That makes me the right age. <clears throat> you look like a good kid. But if you want my advice, give the shit up. You work hard, screw over everybody that you love. Hurt, rob, kill indiscriminately, and maybe just maybe, if you're lucky, you become a three-bit gangster. It's bullshit. Go to college. Then you're gonna rip people off and get paid for it. It's called capitalism. Hmm. So what I saw the other day was like, when a corpse briefly reanimates itself and terrorizes everyone, right? What you saw the other day was a guy dealing with pests. I guess I never saw myself as just a fucking pest. Well. 
And today's lesson's all about humility. Tomorrow we'll try a training montage. A training what? No. I was just lost in an 80s movie fantasy. <laughs> yeah, I can see you spend a lot of time there. Yeah, as much as I can. So that's why you're here in Vinewood then, right? Maybe I'm here because I'm just an idiot who thinks that imported palm trees are a good substitute for not really knowing what the fuck you're doing on this earth. Jesus, man. You a good time, you know that. I tell you what. <sighs> Least I can do is buy you that beer. There's a little bar I like. <sighs> it's not too far from here. Let's go. All right, man. I'm following you. <sighs> Let's take Amanda's car. Hey, Jim. I'm going for a drink. Dad, with... shit. I mean, our boat going down the Western Highway. It's... It's been stolen. What? The yacht's been stolen? I, I was trying to sell it. I know you didn't want it sold, but I need money, and they don't want to buy it. They just want to take it. I'm hiding in the head. You're insane. All right, I'm coming for my boat. All righty, then. Change of plans. My darling boy is in trouble. I'll do what I can to help with that, man. Lesson number one, don't ever have kids. Hey, man, look, if I had kids, I don't think no parenting issues would arise over who had both privileges and who don't. Shit, motherfuckers would be lucky to sit in a bathtub. Shit, things that desperate, huh? Nah, but, you know, shit, I was making a point. Pathologizing self-deprecation. I know it well. Yeah, man, but shit, where the boat at? Little shit's been hijacked. They're somewhere on the Western Highway. Man, ain't you worried? About my boat? Yeah, I am. But you can always buy another boat. Yeah, tell my accountant that. Man, you can always get credit for one. But have you come repo it? No, thank you. <laughs> All right, homie. I ain't your homie. I'm someone you want to impress. Oh, there. There, there it is. That's my boat. Your boat's in a fucking hurry, man. Yeah, well, we'll catch him. What we about to do? I'm gonna get you close, and you're gonna go board that thing. All right, man, shit. Fuck it, let's do this. All right, I got a piece of the glove box. They give you shit, I'll take them out. Oh, that's cool, man. You shoot with one hand and drive with the other. But my motherfucking concern is I might miss the jump and fall in fucking traffic. Oh, fuck this. Ah, too close. My phone. Fuck, kid. Check! Fucking engine! Oh, easy with those bricks! If you hurt my boy or my boat, you're screwing with the wrong retiree! Hey, hey! Over here! Hey, this dude trying to kill me, man! Hey, hey shoot you this asshole! Okay, now go find Jimmy! Dad? Wait, you're the guy from the dealership. Yeah, and it's a long story, bro. Jimmy! No, no, no! Kid, watch out for the boom! Fuck! Ah, Hold on! Dad! Help! 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 Ah, this is gonna kill me. Get under him, man! Let him drop the car! Ah, what the fuck you even doing here? I ain't slipping, bro! Oh, this is it! This is it! Now that doesn't sound good. 
Damn, that's the engine, man. We ain't chasing shit in this thing. Come on, stay with me. Stay with me. Ah, my fucking boat! Hey, it's just a thing. At least you still got a son. Hey, it's a chop shop back there, dog. If you drive us there, we can get the ride fixed. My boat. It's just a thing. My boat. Please stop doing that. Listen, I fucked up, okay? I'm not going to lie. That was a really bad judgment call. But shit, Dad, I nearly died. And all you give a shit about is this fucking boat. No, it's not that. It's all we do is scream at each other. No wonder I can't get a job. It's all your fucking fault. Or it's not, but it's partly your fault. I... I mean, I just want to impress you. By selling my boat to some gangbangers? I know it sounds dumb when you put it like that, but all you do is daydream or get angry. Look, I love you, Jimmy, but you're an asshole. And right now, with my boat disappearing over the horizon, that's all I can see. Franklin, do, you, do me a favor and give this kid a ride home after they fix this thing. I want to headbutt the road in peace. Oh, great. Leave me with the home invader. I'll get it done, dog. No problem. Dad! Enough! All right? Enough! Hey, this the place up here. I know this dude, man. His name How. He gonna look after me. All right, take what's in my pocket. A couple thousand bucks. That'll cover it, right? So you sure you're good? Yeah, I got this. All right. Ooh, uh, I'm gonna come up front. Get out and walk around. It's okay. I can just climb over. Look, man, I'm gonna get the ride uh, fixed, man. And drop it back off at your house along with this dude. It's all good, though, man. You go and get your head right, all right? All right. Listen, thanks for today. I appreciate it. You stop back out to the house, we'll talk. Ugh, you see? Show, sure, man. Hey, sorry we didn't get your boat, man. Yeah. Come on, man. Let's trick this whip, homie. All right, man, I'm taking you home. It's Franklin, right? Yeah, Franklin. Or the credit for our guy. The home invader. You know what? Call me what you like, man. Yeah, I, I, no, I, I mean, sure. Jimmy, ain't he? Or James? Jimmy. Or just like, Jizzle? <laughs> no, nah, man, I'll just stick with Jimmy, homie. So, uh, what's the deal, man? Huh? You and my old man? I see you at the dealership. And someone steals my whip, and Papa's all like, he's been down there to talk to you guys. Your pops did more than talk. What'd he do? Look, man, if he ain't tell you, I ain't gonna tell you. But I lost my fucking job, and I thought maybe he can help me find a new one. Dude, my dad is retired. Like, fully? Like, his only marketable skills are watching TV and daytime drinking. <sighs> man, look, I don't know, homie. He seems okay to me. Shit, he saved your ass. You saved my ass. Nah, nah, man. Well... Well, maybe we good together, you know? Like, maybe we can get shit done we couldn't do separate. If it keeps him out of the house, that's cool by me. <sighs> yeah, well, we'll see. Look, I'm sorry my dad lost to your job. It's hard out there. Tough. I mean, I'm employmentally challenged at the moment. Oh, you got fired, dude. Damn, that's rough. Not fired as such. I, I didn't get a job. I've been there, homie. You've been putting them resumes out there, but no one's hiring them. No, I, uh... I didn't get a job. I've never had a job. It feels like hard work. Life, the days just kind of disappear. Hey, you play right to slaughter? Nah, not since the first couple. Okay. Yo, so like, since we're both unemployed, like, we could run together, you know? Yeah, I think about it, homie. Or, or we could just, like, shop it, you know? Play darts or get our drink on? Strip clubs? Come on, dude, I get real crazy. Yeah, I got your number, shit, I need it, man, but, uh... Hey, hey you know what? Man, go easy on your pops, dog. all right? All right, church. <laughs> exactly, man. My brother from another mother. 
I mean, I, I hope so, because my mom was kind of a skank back in the day. See ya. Yeah, whatever, homie. Peace. <laughs>